Edwin Diaz place. takes over on now the mound now as he'll try to get the final out of the ball game here and pick up a save. From the belt, the pitch. Austin Jackson is at the plate as he looks at ball one. Bases are loaded here, two down. 2-0. Oh. Putting himself in a pretty bad situation now on 2-0, and, oh, and the base is loaded. He basically doesn't have much of an option but to challenge him right here. Adam Hacken at the 2-0 change, and it's back to 2-1. Well, he had big aspirations behind that swing. Pretty obvious he was trying to put four runs on the board in a hurry. And that's cut on and missed. So now the Tigers find themselves down to their last strike. Has them down to their final strike. Here it comes. Now a swing and a ground ball. This should do it. Throw on to first to be in time to get him and the Mariners will add one more to their winning streak as this ball game is over. Man, they've already put the all-time winning streak record in their rearview mirrors. But with every win, it gets further and further away. We could say this now. This is one of the greatest teams in the history of baseball. And tonight's comes to a conclusion. Six to one, the final. Noah Syndergaard earns a league-high 18th win, racking up 14 Ks in doing so. Bobby Borders pitched well, allowing only two earned, but ends up taking the loss. So that's a wrap here tonight. Harold Reynolds, Dan Plezak, Matt Vaskersian, you've been watching MLB The Show. For more, find us on Facebook at MLB The Show. Our final line score tonight, first for the victorious Seattle Mariners. Six runs on 14 hits. No errors. They left six men on base. For the Tigers, one run on six hits. No errors. They left eight men on base. Time of the ball game, three hours and seven minutes. A reminder that for travel through downtown Detroit, pick up the People Mover train outside the stadium at the Grand Circus Park Station, located just beyond the right field gate on Witherell Avenue.